Hey everybody, it's Pookie TVX. Just heard a little rumor. I'm gonna go ahead and entertain it and just take a walk on it and see what I think about it. And you let me know what y'all think about it. Rumor is Meek Mills signed the Drake's label, OVO. What do y'all think about that? Do you think it's a good move for Meek or a bad move for Drake? Or even worse deal for the boss, Ricky Rose. Me, I think it's a good move for Meek. I think Meek could get more fan base, more exposure, more money. Because everybody know Drake killing it. So why not get with a winning team? You was with the MMG, they was winning. But now they done lost Wale. Who else they done lost? And lost a few other people too. And they lost Wale and Wale could spit. So yeah, I think it'd be a good ass move for me. You know? Kind of like uh, LeBron leaving Cleveland and going to the Lakers. Even though I'm not a LeBron fan, but I respect this game. Cause you know it's Golden State Warriors over here. Dub Nation. Just have to throw that out there. But um, yeah, what do y'all think, man? I think it's a good move for Meek, man, to uh, to uh, go out there and get you know and get his uh, get himself back out there, man, in the game, man, and um, blow up. You know, I think he can get a lot of exposure out there and gain a lot of more fan base. And he be doing tours. I mean, I think that'd be a good ass move. It'd probably be a good move for Drake, come to think about it. You know? I mean, it's a funny situation, yeah. Granted, it's a funny situation. You know? But I mean, I don't see I don't see a losing party in there except for um the boss. That's about all I see that's losing in that. Might be a good look, you know. But uh, yeah, it's just a rumor, you know. You know, it's nothing set, nothing set in stone. Just taking a walk on it, see what you know. But I think, yeah, I think that'd be a good move for Meek, man. You know, I think Meek could be able to, you know, boost himself back up in a rap game. You know, because it don't seem like MMG them is putting out nothing really right now. You know, it don't seem like uh, they uh, focus on the artists. You know, I don't know what the hell Rick Ross doing. If that's really Rick Ross. That's another story for another day. But, um, yeah. Y'all let me know what y'all think about that, man. Do y'all think this is a good, you know, a good thing for me? If it's true. You know, because we still don't know if it's true or not. But if it's true, you think this is a good step for me? Or a bad step for Drake. Or good for Meek and Drake and bad for Rose. What y'all think on this one, man? I'ma go ahead and ponder on it. Because yeah, cause me, you know, I like Meek. I, and I like Drake, you know? I don't like the tough shit that he spit because we damn sure know he ain't tough. You know, but he can sing them little them little, them little hooks and shit, the little catchy hooks and shit and you know, you know that, that hotline bling and shit like that. He can sing that type of shit, you know, and get that new generation of people. But you know that that hard shit, no, that you can't. He can't. Mm -mm. It just ain't working. You know, just like genuine, you know, spitting some hard shit. Shit just don't go together, man. Shit just don't go together. Genuine could not spit like uh, Jada Kiss. It, it's just not. It just don't work like that. You know, so maybe that's why he called in Meek to get some hood with him, you know? I don't know, man, but uh, y'all let me know what y'all think on this, man. I'm gonna keep looking into it. You know, I hope the rumor is true. You know, I like to see what happens with that little situation with Meek and uh, Drake and see what they can put out. You know? So, uh, yeah, y'all let me know what y'all think on this, man. I'm gonna keep digging into it and see what I come up with. All right, one.